What is up guys? This is Saipik uh, back with another video. Uh, this is not necessarily a pickups video, um, although I have scored some pretty rad stuff since the last time, believe it or not. Um, unfortunately, a lot of stuff is being packed at the moment uh, for the special announcement that we're going to be at the Portland Retro Gaming Expo this weekend. It's October 21st, 22nd, and 23rd. Uh, we'll be flying in on Friday uh, to set up and uh, hang out and, you know, check out the town, meet up with uh, some of the other vendors and, uh, you know, just whatever. <laughs> Go drink some beers and stuff. Uh, we'll be there till Sunday. Uh, we do have a table, actually three tables. We have a pretty big booth this year. Uh, it, it went very well last year. This convention is humongous. And this year they added like 30 more vendors and it's like sold out as far as vendors go. Tons of big names are going to be there. Uh, check out the website. Uh, just like Google PRG or Portland Retro Gaming Expo website and check it out. Really cool convention. Uh, probably the best in the nation, honestly. Tons of traffic. Uh, and uh, we got a table last year just to kind of test the waters. And we made a ton of money. Sold a lot of stuff. Actually, I made more trades. Like, solid deals uh, over there. People are very, very cool. Um, they're not all like wanting to you know win in the trade I mean they were just down a trade that you know for stuff that they wanted and I was able to get a lot of good stuff last year uh, made money sold a lot of stuff off and um, got a lot of stuff that I, I, I wanted that you know for my collection and stuff like that um, but I have scored some really really good stuff some uh, some turbo lots I did score a turbo another turbo duo lot which I will be taking to Portland um, uh, what else? I did score a Turbo Duo box, which uh, I sent out to one of my buddies in Canada, Jody, um, also from Turbo uh, Turbo Reproductions. Uh, he does a lot of the, uh, the reproduction cue cards. Um, really cool guy. We did a little trade, so that box that I picked up went to him, so that I can't show it to you guys. Um, but uh, some of the other stuff that I picked up, a lot of doubles, like and st that I, you know, I'm just gonna bring with me to the expo. Uh, I was able to accumulate some boxes that I'll bring to trade. Um, so hopefully you guys out there, if you guys need anything, come by our booth. Once again, our booth is uh, booth number 204. And we're going to be near the arcade, uh, just uh, just slightly above where the um, the YouTube celebrities are going to be, like uh, AVGN and, and all that. So uh, come by our booth. We're going to have a ton of stuff. It's like about four or five of us are going to be vending there. Uh, if you need turbo stuff, I'm going to have a lot of stuff. I'm trying to pack uh, as much as I can uh, I might have to leave a lot of stuff behind because I just can't I don't think I'll be able to fit all these systems and all these uh, games uh, on the plane uh, without having to pay um, uh, the big fees that they charge you but I'm gonna try to take as much as I can um, definitely gonna be taking uh, some of the consoles I, I mean if you guys want to check it out uh, let's go ahead and just I'll just turn the camera off I'll come back on and you guys can see all these it's a big mess so, you know, it's, it's usually not like this, but um, right now I'm just boxing stuff up, kind of seeing what I'm going to take, uh, you know, talking to the bros to see what they're going to take so we don't take the same stuff, and so on and so forth. But we are looking for a lot of good stuff. Uh, if you have, like, a KO Flying Squadron, one of my buddies is looking for that. I'm looking for the Final Four Turbo Graphics uh, CD games. I'm looking for Super Air Zonk, Dynastic Hero, Bong 3 CD, and Super Air Zonk, and I'm done. Uh, looking for the five remaining boxes that I need for my complete box collection. Uh, so if you guys got any of that stuff, bring it down. We love to wheel in deal. We love to trade. Uh, and we give fair trade-ins too if you want to trade some stuff in and get some stuff from us. So, uh, And we're going to have a mix of a lot of stuff. Not just Turbo stuff. Some of my friend, uh, other buddies are, are big NES and Super Nintendo guys. I think one of my buddies might bring in Arrow Fighters. Um, among other rare NES games and Super Nintendo games. Um, so just come on down to our booth 204. Uh, we always strive to have like the best, cheapest prices, um, since we're not really a store or anything. We can just sell stuff for whatever we want, basically, so we don't have no overhead or anything. Uh, but like I said, we don't want to bring it back home. Um, but uh, basically, I've been building up stuff all year long just for this expo. So a lot of the stuff here has been just accumulating little by little. Um, and like I said, I've been making deals, getting, you know, buying bundles, keeping what I need, and then, you know reselling or trading away the other stuff so let me go ahead and pause the video right now once again uh booth 204 at the portland retro gaming expo i'm going to turn the camera around so you guys can see what i'm taking if you guys see something you guys want me to for sure take that you would be interested in let me know right away uh because uh basically uh, we're leaving on friday so uh, and today's wednesday so 
Um, and uh, let's uh, stop the chatter and let's turn around and check this stuff out. Okay, so just real quickly, I did want to show you guys that I was able to knock off a couple of extra boxes that I needed for my collection. Uh, I was able to get these two from a buddy of mine. I was able to pick up Final Zone 2 and uh, King of Casino. Believe it or not, these are really hard to find boxes. King of Casino actually is a pretty common game when you go looking for it on eBay. But trying to find the box is pretty tough. Uh, this one is a little beat down, but beggars cannot be choosers, so I'm super excited to have that in the collection. And another buddy of mine hooked me up with uh, Silent Debug... No, it wasn't Silent Debuggers, actually. It was Andre Panza Kickboxing. Um, and that was uh, sent to me by my buddy Jody, uh, which I made uh, the, the duo box trade. We did cash, and uh, I sent him the duo box, and he sent me this. Uh, some really cool items like... Um, this Keith Courage and Alpha Zones manual. It's a it's a uh, Canadian French manual and a TurboGrafx 16 system Canadian also as well, which is really cool. I've never seen these in the uh, white and black versions, and these are uh, uh, Canadian only. Um, and I sent him uh, some TurboGrafx magazines as well, and then he sent me some cash. So let's turn around here and see if you guys can see what we've got here. Let me. Uh, it's really dark in this room here. It's uh, nighttime right now. I uh, just got home from work, but let's see if you guys can catch up. All this stuff is what I'm debating taking with me to Portland. Uh, my backpack, my uh, clothes, which also has some systems inside. But let's take a look. We got some boxes over here and here. Uh, let's kick some of these boxes around and see what's inside here. So let's see here. So this one here, I was able to score some magazine lots. Uh, pretty much uh, two full sets of the Turbo Play magazines. Like I said, some of them went to my buddy Jody uh, already, uh, like about eight of them. But uh, we got a bunch of uh, turbo mags that I'm bringing in. I got a lot of doubles. Uh, really cool. Uh, there's also uh, uh, some Bloody Wolf one in here. Uh, there's just a ton of stuff. And I have more actually in my another section here. But I have like the Bonk. And also um, I believe I have a couple of uh, Darkwing Duck ones. Uh, these are all duplicate boxes uh, and games. Uh, some are box only, some are complete games. We've got a lot of good stuff in here. Let me see if I can turn this around. So if you guys are going to go to this expo in Portland, you guys are going to be lucky because i got tons of stuff. Uh, we've got uh, dual controllers. Uh, we've got, uh, let's see here, uh, more dual controllers. Uh, we've got uh, uh, duo taps. Let's see what else we got here. Uh, Retro Gen stuff, you can see some prices on there. Uh, we've got a lot of uh, games that are just uh, Game and Manual. Uh, Dragon's Curse, uh, we got Pac-Land here. Uh, Alien Crush, JJ and Jeff, The Bonks of Revenge, Dungeon Explorer. We've got the, just the manual and the, the game. Um, a lot of stuff in here. Uh, R-Type, Power Golf, uh, we got uh, Silent Debuggers, we got Loom. Uh, this web browser is not a, really a web browser. It's actually a uh, uh, PS1 game, X-Men vs. Street Fighter. Uh, just missing the back. Uh, we got Sherlock Holmes, Jack Nicholas CD Golf, which is actually pretty hard to find. People confuse it with the Hue Card version. CD version is harder to get. We've got Ordine, Yo Bro, Time Cruise, Tailspin, JB Herald Murder Club. This one comes with all of the murder notes, which is pretty hard to find. Got Psychosis complete in box. Let's see what else we got here. We've got Alien Crush, Bonk's Revenge, another Time Cruise. We've got two Time Cruises in here. Uh, double Dungeons, Blazing Lasers. We've got a Newtopia here. I believe we have two Newtopia CIB available at the show. We've got Ease Book 1 and 2 with the map. Uh, Sherlock Holmes with all the newspapers. Uh, Deep Blue. We've got a Ghost Manor. This Ghost Manor actually is just the box and the... Uh, and the, uh, the plastic tray, uh, there's missing the game, missing the manual, but somebody out there who wants to complete theirs, this will be available as well. Uh, like I said, trays are welcome. Bring your trades, bring good stuff. A um, couple Bravo Mans, we got uh, a couple of Bomber Mans, complete in box. Uh, pretty nice to have. Battle Royal, a really hard to find box. Turrican, in really mint shape. Um, yeah, this is a really hard to find box. Uh, the game is pretty common, but uh, here's another nice one. You got Psychosis complete in box here as well. So it's a couple of Psychosis in, in here. There's one right there and one right here. Let's see what we've got in the other box here. I think this other box has some more good stuff. Let's see here. Pardon me. Oh. 
All right, this box here. We've got some really nice things in this one. Let me go ahead and move up here. Uh, we've got uh, World Sports Competition, Dragon's Curse. I think we actually have two Dragon's Curses. Yeah, there's another Dragon's Curse there. Got Space Harrier, Bloody Wolf. Very hard to find a game in uh, CIB, Victory Run, Magical Dynasty Tour, Bomberman 93, complete in box. That's a really nice one to have, really hard to find. There's the other Newtopia, so we got two Newtopia CIB. We got Tiger Road, Bomberman, another Bomberman, an Air Zonk. This game recently has been selling for about 400 bucks to 500 bucks complete in box. We've got a really nice one here in the box um, with a hang tab still there. It's not sealed, but pretty nice to have that. Uh, tricky kick oh and a really nice one too this one is really hard to find uh, hidden gem Sinistron in the box try finding that out there got legendary axe so that's one box this box has more miscellaneous stuff we got uh, Super Mario Sunshine Metal Slug Anthology a bunch of Super Famicom games uh, we've got uh, some box game gear games we've got uh, some more Super Famicom stuff Let's move this stuff aside here. Let's move these magazines. Let's see what else we got here. Now this is the cream of the crop here. This is my tub and it is full of more games. This is stuff I've been accumulating for the past year or two. Look at that. We've got more dual controllers. Uh, we've got uh, PC Engine controllers, uh, Turbo Graphics controllers. Tons of accessories. We got Turbo Duo extensions. We got uh, Turbo Graphics extensions. Uh, I have like probably about five or six Duo taps and Turbo taps in here, uh, amongst other things that I don't want to pull out of here. But uh, uh, we, I've got um, AC adapters for the Turbo Graphics. I have AC adapters for Turbo Express. I have a uh, AC adapter for the uh, Super the, the, for the CD-ROM system, uh, basically, which is really hard to get. Um, really, really hard to find. Uh, let's see here. We got. Um, some random little games for the Neo Geo Pocket. Leftover stuff from my collection I sold off. Um, let's take a look at some of the games we have here. So we had a CIB Airzonk. And here we have two CIC Airzonks. Look at that. Two Airzonks right here. Where are you going to find... So basically we've got three Airzonks coming to the show. Uh, we've got Alien Crush. Three of them here. We've got Bloody Wolf. Bonk's Adventure. Boxy Boy. A, a CIC Kadash. We've got Chu Man Fu. Uh, let's see here. We've got a cotton disc only, uh, Cybercore, Dragon Spirit, Final Zone 2, hard game to find as well. Two Galaga 90s. Uh, let's see here. We've got the Hudson Collection uh, soundtrack, uh, it's sealed. Uh, John Madden Football, some Keith Courages, some King of Casinos. We've got uh, Last Alert here, another uh, pretty cool game as well. Uh, we've got Legendary Axe, uh, Lords of the Rising Sun with the uh, with a little. Um, uh, some little maps that it comes in, uh, Magical Dinosaur Tour, we got a Monster Lair, another fun CD game to have. Let's see what else we got here, Military Madness, Ninja Spirit, we've got an Ordine right here. So we have, we have one, one Ordine CI, uh, actually this one's missing manual, and then we have a box version uh, in stock here. We've got Parasol Stars, Prince of Persia, we've got a couple of R-types here, uh, Shapeshifters available, we've got two Sherlock Holmes. Uh, we've got Sherlock Holmes 2, uh, a very sought after game here. We got Shockman, uh, Sidearms, Sonic Spike, Splash Lake, Splatterhouse, everyone's favorite game. We've got Valus 2, and I think we have a couple of uh, disc only Valus 3s. Well, actually, this one's a uh, manual and disc only. We've got uh, some disc only Valus 3s, Victory Run, Vigilante. Uh, let's see here, we got uh, just the back for Last Alert. Uh, oh, look at that, Dynastic Hero. That is the just manual only. And Hero Tonma manual only. Uh, it's pretty sought after. We got R Type for the PC Engine. We got a bunch of PC Engine games. We also have a couple of rare uh, Japanese Saturn games. We have, uh, I believe, we have Elevator Action Returns here available as well. Uh, let's see here um, Panzer Dragoon, Sakura Wars. Got some CDI stuff. Uh, now let's move over to just the random systems we got here. Uh, here we've got. Uh, Two Turbo, uh, Turbo Graphics 16 uh, joysticks with the sliders. Usually missing the sliders, these have the sliders. Uh, we've got here a uh, uh, PC Engine shuttle, which I'm debating bringing. We've got a, uh, a core, uh, actually a Super Graphics. We've got a, uh, what do we have here? We have a Turbo Graphics with Turbo Booster Plus. 
controller AC adapter manual. Um, we've got a, uh, a PC Engine Duo R with the controller. Uh, nice uh, everything AC adapter, everything. We've got two of these actually. Uh, we have a bunch of accessories here. Here uh, we have AC adapters, uh, back back covers for Turbo Graphics. We have a Turbo Express recharging system in here. A uh, bunch of good stuff in here. Unfortunately, I'm going to be leaving the uh, the debug unit. Uh, I have a, a box Turbo Graphics over there that can't come with me because it's too big. Uh, those super, the super CD-ROM units over there for the PC Engine are going to be staying. It's just too big to take. I don't have any space. I got a boxed uh, GameCube over there. I know some common stuff. Uh, let's move over here. Uh, let's see here. Sorry if I'm boring you guys, but uh, just all the stuff I'm going to be taking. Got a bunch of Game Gear stuff. A lot of good games here with uh, manuals and stuff like that. Uh, I believe there's a couple of rare ones in here. You got the Shining Force here. Uh, manual and the game. Um, let's see here. Over here we got uh, just some GameCube and PS2 games. Um, some hint books for the Turbo Graphics, which is kind of cool. Uh, we got a couple of SP101s with the uh, with the chargers. Uh, we're perfect. That's the brighter screen model. Over here we got a bunch of other stuff. We got uh, some N64 titles. Uh, check that out. We'll have a Bomberman 64 uh, Second Attack for the N64. Uh, let's see here. I believe there's also a uh, Turtles, uh, Turtles in Time, the not for resale. Um, let's see. We'll have um, in here. I've got some more stuff. Uh, let's see if you can see here. Uh, but in this bag here, we've got the Turbo Duo. Let's see here. Got a Turbo Duo that's coming here. That's a very nice refurbished Turbo Duo. Um, We've got uh, Bonk's Adventure for the NES in here. We've got, uh, let's see here on the side. Um, we've got more Turbo Graphics magazines. Yep, here are the other uh, magazines, the uh, Turbo Graphics. We've got the Darkwing Duck there. Let's put these over here, side. Uh, we've got uh, more games here. Check these out. These are uh, loose, the few card games. Got uh, Jackie Chan, Samurai Ghost, Super Star Soldier, Tailspin, Silent Debuggers, Blazing Lasers. Uh, let's see here. Here we got uh, a few Bonks Revenges, uh, Dungeon Explorer, Final Attack, Military Madness. Awesome game. Uh, we got some PC Engine games here as well as, as far as some other common titles. Uh, they're very sought after uh, Turbo Play Magazine for the uh, uh, Splatterhouse. Um, the CD-ROM uh, promotion. We've got a Turbo Dual Manual that will be available. Bonk's Adventure. There's another Splatter House there. These are all coming to Portland. In here I've got two Core Graphicses. got a Core Graphics, uh, um, just the regular Core Graphics. got a Core Graphics 2, both with the original controllers, AC adapter and cables. Um, just a ton of stuff guys. So if you guys can make it out to the Portland Retro Gaming Expo, uh, definitely uh, it's worth checking out guys. Uh, people uh, got to take my word for it. Uh, we got a lot of new people coming this year that uh, are coming because of the hype and uh i'm pretty sure they're gonna uh they're gonna just they're gonna be happy it's an awesome expo um i'm sweating up a storm in here i'm gonna finish up packing because uh today's my last day here i'm gonna pack up head down to my buddy's house spend the night there and then we're gonna take off to the airport so um yeah if you guys need any of this stuff um hit me up immediately um because if not then uh, some of the stuff might stay here but uh yeah um just got a ton of stuff that, that i gotta go through and you know just kind of purging some dupes and so on and so forth so until next time guys this is cyphic uh, signing out a little out of breath here but uh until next time guys hopefully you guys have a uh, good hunting out there uh hopefully you guys are finding some good scores and until next time uh once again we're at booth 204 stop on by if you're going to be there if not uh, maybe we'll run into you at another convention some other time uh, take care guys late